Lisa Fry, the Catholic unschooler, homeschooler, all around schooler. I'm Lisa Fry, the Catholic unschooler. Today, I have a grocery haul for you. I just went food shopping, I did. But there wasn't anything really fun to parte for Memorial Day weekend. So, and then I, I was shopping and I said to my daughter, I FaceTime her, I'm like, well, we can't really touch this till Monday. And I'm like, wait a minute, that's, this is the, Memorial Day weekend, and this is Saturday. So, I'm gonna show you what I get. I tried being really good. A lot of this, I just, a lot of it, I, I really went there to go shopping for my rabbit. Ha! Okay, spring mix. So wonderful. My rabbit eats that, and so do we. And arugula is wonderful. It's like catnip. It's terrific for people. But the thing is, you have to be super careful. In my experience, you have to chew. Like, it will get stuck down your throat, and it is not fun. Okay. And I got a different kind of lettuce for him, for the rabbit. And I also got him cabbage, because he likes that. He likes to munch on it in the morning. Like, say I get up, and I go to the ladies' room real quick, and then I go back to bed. I'll cut him a chunk and he can eat that. Okay, so then I I bought like three or four, um, Lisa, what is it? Regatta cheese. And I can't use regular pasta for that. And they don't really have, they have gluten-free lasagna noodle thingies, but one of my kids doesn't want that and I probably shouldn't either, so. I bought green and yellow zucchini. Yep, and I'm gonna make those into slices and do it that way. Hopefully they will eat it, and if not, I can help. Yep, all right, my daughter, Sarah, is big into peaches right now. I mean, I, they didn't have regular peaches, but she does like the canned ones. And my son likes milk. Milk, I used to get the really, really big one, but I don't think that's necessary. I think this like kind of hopefully will pace him. Ha, huh, yeah, right. Okay, so my Sarah wanted waffle fries and I wanted, yep, I sure did. Just a little here and a little there. I love these kind of fries and I love it that they're zesty. I'm so excited. <laughs> Okay, moving right along. Now these, that's not all health right there, I know. Okay, pour the rabbit and whatever I wanna put it in my salads. Oh, 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 oh. I love it. I love it and so does he. I got raspberries because I've been making more smoothies lately. I have a great recipe. I think you're gonna love it. And I haven't done it with this yet because I love raspberries. And I find that the frozen raspberries are, or every any kind of fruit is cheaper when it's frozen. So that's the way I go about a lot of things. All right. Grapes, I prefer red, but I'll take any. The girls like the green. All right, it's a beautiful day. I got most of my lawn done. So, you know, I have leaves that I'm supposed to um, leaf blow out of the backyard. I just, I stopped. It was started to rain and I haven't gone to it yet. Straws, we love them in the house. We love them. For our hummus, the snap peas. These are so good. Yes, they are a great snack, you know, instead of like crackers and things that are gonna hurt you. Uh, diced peaches for my daughter, Sarah. I don't think she's ever had this at all before in a fruit cup, maybe. All right, I am so exhausted. Oh, can I tell you? I laid down in my bed near my window. It was wonderful. The weather was so perfect today that I did not need a blanket. I just naturally just fell right to sleep. It was so, you hear the birds. It was magical or heavenly. All right, so I already started eating these because that's what we do here in the Fry family. You want to get these. They're amazing. This is a cheddar kind. I don't know if you can see it. The best chips on the planet Earth. If you like, if you like cheesy Pringles, that is exactly what this tastes like. And it's weird because you go, it's avocado oil. When you go and you look at your hand afterwards, it's not greasy. And you're like, what? Why? 
All right, and we are big time into lemons. Oh yeah, my sour cuts into it and she eats it just like that. Me, I like to just drizzle it in my drinks now. Just anything and everywhere. I just, I know that they're wonderful and they just taste so good. This is like my best friend. Wait, did I just say that the lemons were my best friend? Like, I don't even remember saying that. I'm sitting here editing and, did I just really say that? <sighs> What's wrong with you, Lisa? Actually, I should probably somehow find a recipe because I did buy 100% chocolate and I could put healthy sugar in it and I could put lemon. I mean, it's up there with chocolate for me, if not more. Yep, I did say that. Yep, I love lemon. And if it's lemon and chocolate, I don't, I don't, I don't know if that goes together. All right, uh, now we gotta stretch. I parked all the way at the end of the parking lot the last two times. Yep, I just chose that way because I gotta get steps in, right? We gotta stay strong. Anything you can do to stay strong, do it. Okay, so they want $8, okay, for a very small watermelon, and I was not going to do that. So, I mean, you're spending, you're spending a lot of money anyway, even when you buy it in chunks like this. But, let's see. Yeah, $2.30 for this thing. I mean, come on. Give me a break. All right. You know, what am I even saying when I'm making videos? I have no idea, apparently. Let's listen to that again, shall we? Break. You're just going to have to be forgiving. Okay. I got two of those actually. I'm really tired. All right, to make things a little bit more interesting, I, this is like my fourth pineapple that I had to throw. I didn't throw this one away, this is the fourth one. I threw three others away. I should. That ice machine is awesome. I hope I don't throw this out. I really need to get to it. My problem is, is that I don't always want it. Wow, I was just noticing all the breakout that I had on my chest. My problem is, is that it's from this little critter. And I'm like, I don't know exactly when it's ripe. I could look it up, but I, it's just another thing to do. So I don't. And I got a cantaloupe. Hoo, 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 hoo. These are usually you can tell. These are so wonderful. I can't even tell you right now how delicious that is. All right. I got pickles. We all love pickles, but Sarah loves them the most. And it's good for her because it's got vinegar in it. And that is good. All right, let me empty out some of these bags because I can't do it one hand. I'm so tired that I just have to, let me do it this way, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. I got it all laid out on the table. I have to go kind of fast because my daughter needs the table. Okay, let me show you. I do enjoy these car balance things because these wraps, because they literally, I can't see a thing without my glasses on. I know I should put them on, but I don't feel like it. I think it's like four grams from my, my memory. I don't eat a lot of white flour these days, like compared to where I was, like not at all, okay? So I, I do allow that. Okay, and strawberries. These chips are the best. These are not the cheddar, those are the best. These are also very good. It's the same brand. Anything from them is just wonderful and it's terrific. And I think it literally comes with just like a number, look at the ingredients. Uh, I don't have my glasses. Oh yeah, look at that. Potatoes, avocado, oil, and sea salt. Like, give me a break. They are expensive, like three something. I think it's three seventy nine, and you don't even get a whole bag. You know how they do that. Here's your other watermelon. Two ra black raspberries. I got some good steaks to put on the grill on Monday. And I got my daughter one of these. I always get one for each of us. We're the only ones that really like them. Uh, okay, sour cream. My daughter swears by this drink. I don't even know how you say that, okay? But she swears by it, she loves it. So I thought, let me, we'll share these between all of us. There's a couple of different kinds. She said the watermelon kind was terrible. The blueberry was great. And I'll try these other ones. We'll pour them in little cups and share them. 
and juice i'm not a big juice person at all like at all like i never drink it but i figured it's memorial day weekend i didn't want to get seltzer water because they only they come in the big those big boxes and it's all one flavor or you gotta get the big bottle so i was just like you know what we'll share all these the um it was all natural sugar even though you know it's still sugar uh let's see this is purple kale for the rabbit mickey loves his carrots with the tops on them and this is i believe can't see. I, I don't i can't see anything about my glasses on uh i want to say parsley or cilantro and that's the same thing and this is dill we love a good deal bread especially the low sodium one sarah's getting a little sick of it but i love it and so does seth and rachel do too i bought two of these so i can make my reese's peanut butter cups and i did we're gonna eat those too now that's got white flour on it right special occasion right do we do it all the time no Mashed potatoes, yes, we can make them, but I don't feel like cooking that much. So Rachel loves these, so we'll have those. We'll have a big party. Then moving along over here. I couldn't resist. My son loves these cookies, and they are sugar cookies, and I sent it to him. He doesn't know that I got it for him. I said, thinking of you, but I bought it. He loves it so much, and they are so, so tasty. Oh, my gosh. For the rabbit, for the rabbit. Also, for me, if I want a salad, potato salad. Yes, we could have made it, but I don't want to. And bananas. And I'm not sure if Rachel will eat these, but I'm not sure. She's, I don't know. I don't know if we're going to eat those. I probably won't eat a real hot dog right now. I'm not in the mood. So, corn dogs. I, I know that all of this stuff is garbage. It is. It is. Um, I can't believe I actually got my son to like these these are buffalo chicken patties i i don't really care for the regular ones but these are the spicy ones and they're so good so good especially in a wrap with some avocado and a lot of lettuce and some cheese and oh and i think so i think that wraps it up ladies and gentlemen look there's a been a cake there has been a cake sitting here and i have not touched it that, that's about the only thing i've touched see look that's it i can have I can have sugary things in this house that belong to someone else and I don't even touch it. And yeah, I might go, oh, wow, it looks really good. But I am no longer, it's not a struggle to say no. I know the dishes again. Yeah, it's not a struggle to say no for me. It just isn't. I'm not like trying to fight it off. I, it's been like four or five months now and I just, it's over. It's over. I don't care. You know, do I go around and go, yeah, 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 I really want something sweet. Yeah, but that's why I make the chocolate right? You put erythritol or any kind of monk fruit, healthy sugars. Always look at the ingredients. Don't look at the front of the package and believe it. It's a lie. And I put those together. I put some, maybe some coconut oil and I put it with peanut butter and there's a video if you want to know about it. All right. I'm going to go put the stuff away. I need to go lay down. I need to just do nothing. All right, well, thank you so much. God bless you very much. And I hope and pray that you have money, that you can go and buy the things that you really like and that you really enjoy and that are really healthy for you. All right, so God bless you. Uh, remember to please pray for Mr. Fry, my beloved husband that passed away. Please pray for my beloved father who also went with him. So no matter where I go, I will be happy. And please pray for my Sarah. Yes, she is doing much, much better and um, still occasionally not feeling well. Hopefully she can go to a friend's pool tomorrow. Maybe she hasn't done anything like that since her she recovered from cancer. And you don't want cancer, guys. Just be careful what you're eating, please. Don't eat sugary things all the time. I, I just can't see it, it going down too well and doing your body good. You don't want cancer. It's just terrible. And um, remember that God is good all the time. God is not only good when things go well. He is good even in the midst of all the storms and while we're carrying our cross. So God bless you. I love you. And be good, be good. <laughs> be good, be good, be good. Remember that song? All right, by the minute work. There you go. All right, God bless. Bye-bye.